antenna mast for the Wilson wireless repeater antenna that I put on my shop building. I was having a lot of trouble with signal. Let's see if I can zoom in on this. This antenna is actually very small. It's going a little slow. A little bit blurry. And it's ran down with the LMR 400 cable just directly into the attic. Uh, that pipe there is a gray conduit pipe. I have a piece of galvanized conduit inside it that's two inch with a piece of inch and a half or inch and a quarter, I can't remember, whatever fit inside there. And I put caps on the end to try and keep the mud daubers out. We get a lot of wasp hair, we call them mud daubers that build mud nests and I just tried to give them one less place to build their nest. Let's go into the attic and look at the wireless repeater. Okay, sorry I was just way too close for that. Uh, this is a wireless repeater. You can see by me putting my hand up there, I mean it, it's actually really small. This is a 65 dB which is industry standard. So it really is a pretty good one. It works great. Uh, if you have any signal whatsoever, this works great. You have to point the antenna on the outside of the building towards your an antenna that you're getting cell service from. So you have to know where that is and you can see the lights on there. The one that is lit is green. I don't think it's going to focus, but that's your go signal. You got everything right when that's lit. Uh, before, I was getting, oh, inside the shop building, I'd get the tower signal. Sometimes I'd get one bar, and basically, you can't talk. I was too far out of range. I was about, I think it was, it. I don't understand this stuff, but I think it was like minus 107 or 107 dB, which basically you can't talk at where my location was. When I installed this thing, uh, I'm getting full strength on my phone pretty much everywhere inside the shop except for where the machines are. Uh, there's just too much interference in there. I'm getting about four bars in there, so you can talk if the machines aren't running. Anyways, I'll head on down and check out the phone. Okay, here's my phone. It's just an old phone. I really just use a phone for a phone. I don't get into going on the internet or texting or anything, but this is my Sprint PCS phone. Let's power it on. When you read the instructions on that amp, it says to make sure that all your devices that are going to be hooked up to that are powered off. Let's see. Right here at the machine, I'm getting two to three bars. Getting it off the machine a lot better. And I mean, standing right here before I had this amp, I wouldn't get any signal at all. It's just very difficult to get any kind of signal whatsoever. Anyways, you can see it, it's working great. Uh, I would suggest if you're going to buy one of these wireless repeaters, I bought the Wilson. You need to read the instructions before you install this stuff. I didn't read the instructions until afterwards. They actually don't give you enough cable for what it says. They say that for the 65 dB, you need to be 60 feet away from your indoor antenna to your outdoor antenna. I'm at like 30 feet, so uh, it's working. They don't give you enough cable. Anyways, that's about it for this one. Thank you.